Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving deep into the world of press brakes. We'll be revealing the structure and components of these fascinating machines, and we'll be focusing on the most popular variant, the CNC press brake. So let's get started. Press brakes come in various types, including manual, hydraulic, and CNC press brakes. But today, we're focusing on the CNC press brake, also known as the electrical hydraulic servo press brake. This machine is popular for its precision and efficiency, thanks to its servo system and linear scale. The main body of the press brake consists of two C-shaped frames on the left and right sides. The bottom workbench and the top crossbeam are connected to these frames, forming the plunger section. This section is composed of a crossbeam with a top punch and a workbench with a bottom die. The back gauge provides precise positioning functionality. Now let's take a closer look at the components of the CNC press brake. We have the frame, the ram, the workbench, the back gauge, tool clamps, punches and dies, the hydraulic system, the control system, safety devices, and more. Each of these components plays a crucial role in the operation of the press brake. So, there you have it. A comprehensive look at the structure and components of a CNC press brake. Whether you're new to press brakes or an experienced operator, understanding these components can help you operate these machines more effectively and safely. Thank you for joining us today. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more informative videos like this one. Until next time, stay curious and keep learning.